Hi everyone, I'm going to quickly go through my Daiso haul. This is actually my first ever Daiso haul. I've known about Daiso for a while, but I've actually never actually had time to step in and actually buy anything or, you know, so I guess I went loose today. So, I'm just going to quickly go through for what I have. My battery might die as well recording this. I hope not. Okay, so I have the receipt. Spend around $56. That's not too bad, is it? It was a bit excessive for Daiso. So, okay, I'm just going to go through the items on the receipt so I don't forget anything. That's probably the best way to do it. So, first couple of things is um, money box. I got this piggy one. I think there was a cute bunny one as well, but I couldn't decide. I went with the piggy in the end. And I also got another one for my friend. I don't know. It's like an Asian character. I can't... I don't know what it is. <laughs> but I got that one for her. Okay, and then the next item I got was a mouse pad. It's huge. It's giant. Covers my face. But I prefer one smaller, but that's the one they have. I think I might have that. I am one of those people who actually use a mouse with a laptop. I know that you don't need a mouse, but I feel I need to. I don't know if it's ha work habits or what, but I struggle to use a laptop without a mouse. And I lost my mouse pad a while ago, you know, when I was changing jobs. I forgot to take it home with me and I haven't really found a mouse pad since. I've been waiting for Kiki K to release one. It's been years now, I guess, and nothing. They used to have really nice mouse pads, but I never picked it up back then. So it's nice to have something pink as well. I think my friend wanted that mouse pad, but she didn't like pink. So had to choose something else. Okay, next thing. Okay, so... Next thing is like a plastic case. It says plastic case. I don't know what it is. Okay. This is more like a trio storage thing for makeup and stuff. I'm just going to use it just to decant things or transfer things over. So it's three. These are the square designs and they stack on top of each other. So, you know, good for traveling, good for whatever. Okay. So. Next is. It says. I'm back. <laughs> Two drawer plastic. It's cute. Just to give reference for size. What will I put in it? To be honest, no idea. But, oh well, I'll find something for it. Okay, and I also got a towel. I watched this in one of the videos. The long towel. It's pretty long. But it's just, to me, it just looks like um, a hand towel. Or a bit longer. Um, this is not for me. This is more for my brother for the gym so why not um i have one that he kind of borrows if he runs out of his but it's like a sports girl purpley one it's got a zip which is pretty cool but i just figured he he needs his own towel and he can stop borrowing mine when he's his dirty one more extra towel on rotation but not for me though so i think of other people too um okay and then um my friend gave me this. This is like a moisture essence. She thinks it's a really good product. She's a Daiso fan, obviously, so she knows all the products there. Um, she goes, just put one drop in your moisturizer and it should soften your skin. So it says here, hydroronic acid. So people who are not familiar with this, like, you know, because it's Asian cosmetics or Japanese, whatever. It's the same ingredient in the Nano Blur. I think. No, no. I'm wrong. Sorry. <laughs> I'm wrong. It's the Hydrolon. Yes, Hydrolon by Nano Blur, I think. I don't know. It's that brand they stock in Priceline. Hydrolon. It's the sounds it's the same ingredient, I think. So, uh, another friend of mine told me that this is this ingredient is pretty popular in Asian skincare, so there you go. And that is $2.80. Hydrolon is not $2.80. <laughs> but but yeah. Okay, so the next one is let me check i don't even know what that is but anyway um i'll just do what i have so next is just a travel set i think this was the last one and i thought you know what i need a sp spray head whatever just have it ready on hand i'm just not going to use it just pretty much put it in my drawer if i need it I, I can put it in the other day i was looking for like um a spray to create my um sanitizing spray for my brushes but i found a bottle I'm trying to upcycle or recycle, so I end up finding one, but just have that in case if I need to travel, bring something with me. Next, my friend showed me this one, an atomizer. 
very useful, can decant my perfume, and it's tiny too. I have bought an atomizer like years ago. It costed me $15, and this costed me $2.80. This actually has a nicer design than the one I have. The other one's like some ugly pink, purpley, tacky looking thing, to be honest. It used to be when Perfume Connection or whatever sold it. I need an atomizer, and I don't even know if I've used it again. And I paid $15. So this one's quite nice. I can afford to like buy 10 of them. <laughs> And next, peppermint oil. I bought this so that um, I read somewhere that you can make like a, your own spray bottle to sanitize your brushes. A bit of peppermint makes it nice or helps clean it or whatever. So I just bought this. Okay, just to note, my friend noticed the same thing. She wanted to buy the lavender one to put on her skin or something. But this is more for oil burning. And there is even a note where it says... Keep away from your eye, skin, or membrane. So I'm kind of worried. Can I put this drop in? Maybe I'll put like two drops in my whole mixture bottle. I don't know. Brushes. I guess I'll put it on my face. I'm not sure. I can't decide. Hope it's safe. I don't know. Let's hope for the best. But definitely do not use it undiluted to your face. Too strong. And not for your skin. Next lot. More cases. Like, you know, just, you know, for travel nothing exciting and I bought this nail jewel kit not that I'm gonna do anything but mainly okay I just thought you know what you're gonna pay for like containers empty containers like these but these are different sizes but you could buy this empty I might as well just take all the glitter out and stuff and could use it for next time but I might these sizes remind me of Mecca's sample pots maybe a touch bigger but I thought um, you know, my friend who we can exchange stuff, we can decant and then swap. I thought this is a good size. So I got that. Okay, next. Got myself like a cushion. Covers the screen. It was like a cushion. I thought, well, I'm always sitting on my chair. Might as well sit in comfort. Don't know if it's good or bad, whatever. $2.80. How can you go wrong? So, you know, got the cushion. Okay, got this small container. I don't even really know if I need it, to be honest, but it's cute. You know, zip open. I do have one of these a bit bigger, and I also have a Missoni one, which is even bigger than the one I have, but I haven't used it, so... It's pretty small, just to give size comparison. Let me see. This is the iPhone 4. Put this in. Ooh! size comparison so yeah it's small it is small but very handy you know take with you maybe i'll zip it up just so you get an idea but yeah like you know when you want decent amount of makeup to carry with you i know you can use like a cosmetic case but maybe you just want it standing up or all compacted and you know could squish it into your suitcase or overnight bag whatever yeah so there it is it's small it's cute though I'll find a use for it, I think, I hope. And what else did I get? I got this. It's not big at all. Size comparison, again, similar. Just so. I got this because, you know, I can put all my travel documents, passport and all that file in one place. Not going travelling anytime soon, but at least it'll be ready there. I did have one of these type things that I bought from Officeworks or something, but I don't. I think it's been a bit worse for wear, so time to update. And I actually think, honestly, it's not because it's quality is pretty good. Big plastic. The other one is like more like a bit thicker than plastic sleeve, but not the best. Okay, and this finally tray. Oh, tray. So this is A4 tray, pretty much. I got this from the stationery section as well. So just to put my stuff, you know put it all, I can organize better. I'm not the best at organizing, but obviously being pink and whatnot and cheap, it should help me. I think there is one more item that I have not mentioned, but it's nothing special anyway. It's like a storage container. I cannot see it. I cannot see it. Let me see if I can see it. No, I, ha I can't find it, but it's nothing special. It's just like a tin... Um, container just so I can put all my brushes in it but you know if 
can't find it. And also, I think I might have missed some items. I decided to stop looking at the receipt. It got too confusing. It just would say container, but, you know, I bought a few. So I don't know which one is what, but, you know. Um, I also bought bookends. Um, they had smiley faces, but I think they're a bit creepy looking. Do I read books? No, but do I have books? Yes, and I can probably use bookends on them. Bookends are usually pretty expensive, I think, but, you know, it's a heart design. A bit sissy, but acceptable sissy, I think. So, yeah, so I got them. I'm just thinking, have I missed anything? But I think that's about it. I don't even know where I put the receipt now. I've just somehow managed to lose it in the process. Yes, I can't find my receipt. I put it somewhere. But that's pretty much it. I think I've covered everything. The main things. But yeah, that's my Daiso haul, the first one. Maybe many more to come. But I'm trying to be more selective in what I need. But I think these will do me for now. So until next time, I'll see you. But let me know what you think I should get. Definitely, I do know one thing I, I do need to find and get which they didn't have at that store, is the Puff and Sponge Cleaner. Definitely on the list. And I know there's the charcoal mask. I saw the charcoal foaming cleanser, but not the actual mask. I don't know. That I'm not urgent for that. I already have enough face masks. But yeah, anything else you think that I need that I haven't got, let me know in the comments below. Thank you. Bye.